as a terebinth tree or as an oak whose stump remains when it is cut down so the holy seed shall be its stump. God the Father laid the foundation of salvation and completed it through Jesus Christ. God the Father made Jesus be born on this earth, take upon the sins of this world once for all by receiving his baptism from John the Baptist and be crucified and shed his blood on the cross. In other words, Jesus Christ has become the holy stump on this earth and God has perfectly saved all those who receive the remission of their sins by knowing this Jesus Christ and placing their faith in him. God has made it possible for all those who understand and believe in the gospel word of the water and the spirit to become the people of the kingdom of heaven. The holy seed on this earth is Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the Father. It is he who came to this earth, blotted out all our sins, and turned his believers into God's own people. God said here that the word of power, the word of the remission of sin that Jesus Christ fulfilled has now become a stump on this earth and that through Jesus Christ, the believers have become God's people and his kingdom has been established. As we have been taught by the parable of the sower, we can all become God's own children when we admit our wickedness and believe in the gospel power of the water and the spirit.